Hey Pisces and Pisces lovers and friends. Welcome back to the Pisces portal. This is going to be a general reading for Pisces Collective. So it might resonate, it might not. Okay, okay. Pisces, let's see what our week is going to look like. Okay, so Pisces, we have the Ten of Swords. The King of Swords. Mm, the world. I was waiting for it. I was waiting for it. <laughs> okay, and let's see. And... The Two of Pentacles, Pisces, definitely looks like this week you are going to be putting some very heavy and troubling energy behind you, okay? I feel like you've been hurt or victimized in some way. There are some things that you have just been carrying around with you for some time now. But this door is about to close, okay? The door to this pain, um, sadness, feeling like you have to always be um, on guard on the defense okay like the king of swords here has on some you know got on some knee pads okay like it's really real this new and and you know i think even though of course i'm doing a reading about it right i still feel as if you might be unaware that this chapter is coming to an end. You might not be able to see how. You might not be able to, um, you know, get any indication from anywhere within or without that this is about to be over in terms of you letting go, okay? I feel like spirit is going to present an opportunity to you that allows you to really get closer to the light, okay? To really transmute that negative energy, okay? Because whatever you've kind of been on the battlefield, so to speak, um, fighting for or against, um, you know, that time again is coming to an end. A new door is opening for you, okay? And it's going to provide you with some choices. Um, some of you are going to get new opportunities in work, okay? Um, it might be a little difficult to decide what you wanna do with this new opportunity, but I feel like the biggest and most important thing is letting go of this heavy burden, um, really healing from whatever this is here. So let's see what other messages we get about this week. Yes, okay, Pisces, your healing is coming. Spirit is with you. Um, and yes, this this cycle truly is coming to an end. Um, pain does not last forever. You know, people say that good things come to an end, but so do the bad, <laughs> okay? Spiritual growth. I think that, you know trying to work through your emotions, trying to manage your life, make certain decisions, 
you know, after getting into this Ten of Swords energy has all, you know, truly been for your growth, okay? For um, your betterment. Let's see. empowerment and look more light okay so you are about to really empower yourself this week when it comes to getting over um this you know this pain these hurdles these emotional outbursts okay Wow, Pisces. Yeah. Peace that passes all understanding. Because like I mentioned before, you might not be receiving any indications of healing coming your way. Um, of even feeling empowered, you know, or getting over um, these really deep and dark, painful emotions. But... Peace is coming your way this week, Pisces. Okay? Ooh, energetic clearing. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. During crises, the Holy One herself may be emptying you of fear and attachments, preparing you to receive her luminous plan. You know what? <sighs> wow. <laughs> okay, so this is a week of deep energetic clearing. I mean, this <laughs> woman has gone from being face down in a puddle of her own blood to being freaking resurrected. Okay? That's what's happening this week, Pisces. Total transformation. Let me get another one from this deck. <laughs> yeah, the energy... This negative energy is being cleared out to make way and room for new energy, for more peace. You know what? Limitless. See yourself open to receive in the most miraculous ways. The divine can use anything and anyone. Okay, so this is also what this yes card is about. And what the world is about, Pisces, okay? Limitless opportunities for you to receive something new. Something for you to say yes to. Okay? feel like this is some something that has been waiting for you. It's like something that has been on the other side of your pain. Perhaps that, you know, you didn't see. You, you didn't hear, you know, you were just totally unaware of whatever this is, okay? Whatever it is that spirit wants to give you, your focus was so, you know, so into this Ten of Swords energy, okay? Or, you know, being the King of Swords or maybe competing or, you know, being combative with a king or a queen of swords type of individual. Okay. Let's see what else we have here. Pisces. 
perseverance, I know that I can do whatever I set my mind to. Pisces, you are about to have more faith in yourself, more faith in spirit. Um, just your ability to conquer and to move beyond some really rough stuff. And then we have denial. I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. This is what this spiritual growth is about, Pisces. Okay? You being aware <laughs> of where you've been, being aware of this pain. Okay? But replacing it with whatever spirit has in mind for you, whatever knowledge and insight um, comes to your awareness from the divine. So let's get some advice. Ooh, two. So the first one is creativity sees the day. I feel like this is, <laughs> you know, you're going to feel renewed, okay? You're going to feel like you have the energy and um, the optimism to seize the day, to be more creative, to follow through with things that have held you back. Okay, and, and when you do, you're going to be able to see the abundance um, in all ways and forms that's available to you. And then this is what spirit wants you to know. Safety, you are held. Okay, so even though you've gone through a very rough time, okay, um, spirit is with you. Okay, this energetic clearing might not be easy to, but while you're going through it, spirit is with you every step of the way, Pisces. So let's go ahead and get a angel answers message. If you believe, Pisces, you know, this healing, this shift, this clearing, um, and all of the great and wonderful things that come with it can and will happen for you if you believe, okay? Pisces, this has been your weekly reading. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you later. Bye.